Now for Eyewitness News, call 12 for action. When a Block Island bed and breakfast failed to open for the summer season, some vacationers were stuck where nowhere to go. A spokesperson for the Attorney General's office tells us the office received 16 consumer complaints, so they launched an investigation. Eyewitness News consumer reporter Susan Cable joins us now with what she's learned. According to court documents, the owner of the bed and breakfast didn't give vacationers proper notification that his inn was closed. Many of them had already paid at least part of their bills. On its website, the Island Home Inn promises inviting rooms. But this season, when guests arrived for vacation, the inn was closed. One of our viewers alerted us to the issue. He asked that we not use his name, but he agreed to share his story. We booked a room for a four-night stay back in January for, for a stay in July. When he found out that the inn was closed, he canceled the reservation. He says he's still waiting for his $667 deposit. I've been emailing pretty much every day for a month and still no reply. Karen Ford owns the Barrington Inn right next door to the Island Home Inn. She says vacationers have shown up at her front door asking for help because they had nowhere to go. Every day I get people calling me every day to find out if I have vacation to try to to try to accommodate people that are displaced by him. I've been able to help when I can, you know, with open space, but it's the busy season. People are very frustrated. We're frustrated as innkeepers and people that live here that we have someone who who's running his business like this. Now the Rhode Island Attorney General's office is investigating. We obtained a document which ordered David Chifo, the owner of the Island Home Inn, to appear for a civil investigative demand. A spokesperson for the Attorney General's office confirmed Chifo showed up Thursday afternoon. She says the meeting was productive and that Chifo has promised to refund deposits and resolve all 16 consumer complaints. The attorney general spokesperson also told me the inn has reopened and will take reservations through Columbus Day weekend. I tried to get in touch with David Chifo at the inn and also on his cell phone. He has not returned my calls. If you have a consumer problem you need help solving, contact our call 12 for Action Center Monday through Thursday from 11 until 1. Our hotline is 228-1850. I'm Susan Campbell, Eyewitness News.